All right, new day, new episode, new trying to find the same old problems. Solutions to the same old problems, at least. So where the heck could Basil be? He wasn't at the park. He's got to be at somebody's house. You know what? If the bike kids were gone too... Huh. I wonder if they're at the same place. Oh, hello again. I must thank you again for helping me get my medicine yesterday. You know, you kids remind me of two of my young sons when they were young. Those two were quite different from each other, but got along very well. People would always say they balanced each other out. <laughs> I may not look it, but I'm turning 64 this year. I've had seven kids in my lifetime, but everyone's moved out except my oldest son and my youngest daughter. My eldest son never leaves this room, though, so he probably won't ever leave. Oof. I was pitching her a lot older than I thought she was, but I saw a wheelchair, so... Oh my god, don't tell me. Of course. Of course. I cannot begin to prolificate the proposal of mundane scribbles amongst one another on deflated parchment. If you're going to scribe me something, please do so in the most modern entrapment in Parliament. Heh. <laughs> I see to thee. Is that a pet rock? It gawks like a little weakling. Barter, you won't stand a quark against my mantra king. <laughs> Shall we ostracize a clash to conclude an empire? I shall reign splendiferously. Huzzah, you incumbent buffoon. You'll be sorry for that. Prepare to be embellished. Let's go, Mantra King. Okay, so he doesn't seem like one of the big four. I would expect him to be, though. Oh, this guy's like... Normal level. I meant to hit rock. Oh, it worked. All that big talk and you lost in like five seconds. Psh, undo that impertinent facade off your maw. You just got lucky, that's all. I bequeath this hat to you, which I look, which I see you look upon with awe. Now be gone. You got a fedora. <laughs> How fitting. How fitting. Why, yes, that peripheral you ponder over there is my duly betrothed. I'd appreciate if you'd keep your optical appendages in their sheaths. She assimilates my confab better than anyone and anything else. She's such a sweetheart, and we love each other. Now leave us alone. That's... He's an... <sighs> if I was his grandmother, I'd, I wouldn't be able to help but sit there and go, Man... Where'd I go wrong? Where did I go wrong? My parents think I'm bad, okay? My parents would always be like, oh, Sokka, you always on that game. You need to get outside, spend time with some people. And I'm like, dude, I don't like half of these people in the first place. There's a love letter on the table. Wonder who it could be for. Fancy tea party for two. Like, and I I'm nowhere near that bad. I am very much grounded to reality. I just happen to prefer my alone time, and I'm an introvert. But I'm not a shut-in. This guy is like a... There's, there's probably like a Japanese term for it. That dude is like withdrawn from society and glued to his computer. I am nowhere near that bad. Like, that dude really does need to get out and do something. I forgot the run. I forgot what button it was to run. I just remember it now. Really, I was just pressing around the controller to find it. I was like, man, I, I remember I can run. I just don't know what button it is. Um... All right, no one's answering. Got it. Okay, so Basil's house is down here. That dog was down here. 
So let's see if the dog went back. It did. Ugh, Lucas, don't worry me like that. Hey, did you send Lucas back here? I'm sorry for the trouble. Here, take this. You got a paintbrush. You got trash. How kind of you. Does every animal just carry trash in this universe? Hmm. Oh, okay. I can't actually get in front of it to see. Weird. Yeah, an unfinished painting. Uh-huh. You don't say. Okay. This is the bathroom. Pretty standard. Um, washer and dryer in the bathroom, though. That's different. Do you want to look through a faux fact? Faux facts? Faux facts. I'm an artist. Uh, this person is. Oh, hold on a minute. This is the person. So whoever made this, that's the sister. This is Kel. That's Omori. <laughs> Thank you for reading. Whose room is this again? Angel? There's some shiny trading cards on the table. Hey, I have some of those. Yeah, I don't know whose house this is, but... Hmm. Okay, let's go find Kel. Wait, Kel's with us. Let's go find Basil. So Basil's not on this street. I'm thinking the next best place to check would probably be Basil's house. Wait, Polly's not in the house, so we can't get in the house. Okay, I have no idea what to do now then. Um, maybe now we check the church? I, I forget when we did check the church, actually. I thought we checked it earlier. Um. Hey, it's you guys again. You here for moral support or what? <laughs> I really appreciate it. Come on in, I'm almost done fixing this dang leak. faith in you, man. You got this. <laughs> and good riddance. in this man-shaped hole and find a seashell. Yo! You, you good? He just bust through the whole house. You know, technically speaking, with where the hole is, um, he should have ended up in the bathroom. Or at least he should have ended up in here. What the heck? I've never... I, I, I didn't think he'd get so mad that he'd run through his wall. That's wild. Alright, well, maybe he'll uh, fix the hole next time. Maybe. What? I don't know. Weird. Okay. Um. Nothing. I, I, I would almost have to assume that he's in the cemetery. I'd almost have to assume. Can I check these houses too? I checked these houses. He's not on any of the houses on our street, so he has to be at the park. 
and I'm just blind. Probably. Right? Because there's nowhere else he could be. But the park was the first place we checked. I'm missing something. Here we go. Man, where could Basil be? I don't see him anywhere. Somebody, help! Sokka, did you hear that? I think it was Basil. Yeah, my boy. Help me! Please! Where is his voice coming from? Through the trees. Hold on a sec. I know this area. The, the secret pond. Basil's voice is coming from our old hangout spot. Knew it. The entrance should still be somewhere around here. Thought so. Uh, that, that's... I, I know, look, I'm trying to save, okay? okay? Calm down. So, I was right, he was at the park, I just needed to go up to that clearing. I thought something would be up there. A lot of road clear signs for no reason. There's the scooters! Of course! Help me! Somebody! What the heck are you yelling for, Basil? You're making a scene! This place is our secret hangout spot. You can't be here because you weren't invited. Dang it, Basil, be quiet. Someone's gonna find this place. Yeah, we're not trying to hurt you. We just want you to get out of here. Hey, stop it. What are you doing to Basil? What the? Oh, it's killing Sokka again. Why do you always show up? How did you even find this place? Come on, Aubrey, we gotta defend our turf. Aubrey? <sighs> Go away, Kel, you're not welcome here. This is our spot. Oh, it's your spot now. Well, this used to be our old hangout spot, wasn't it, Aubrey? Watch it, or we'll mess you up. Fine. If that's how it's going to be, then at least stop bullying Basil. We weren't even doing anything to him. He just started screaming for no reason. Yeah, sure you weren't. Why should I believe you? We're telling the truth. Stop being such a self-righteous prick. Come on, guys. Let's make sure this is the last time these two maps will us. It sounds good to me. I'm right behind you, the Maverick. Let's settle this, Cal. If you and Sokka are gonna pick a fight with me and my friends, you got one. Come on, gang. Let's teach them a lesson. I have to fight six people. This is not gonna end well. All right, let's fight. Um, skill, focus, skill, encourage. That's not an un, that's not a negligible amount of damage. Okay, fight, attack, the hooligans, just all of them, got it. That hurt. That didn't. Okay, fight. Uh, Sokka, use... Uh, huh, I have a toy. Pepper spray for self-defense only. I mean, there's like six of them. Maybe I should save it. Let's save it. Uh, Kel, snack on pie. Does that actually do anything? Toy. Uh, bandage. Okay. Oof. Seven damage. 
Seven. I did seven damage. It's pepper spray time. Okay. They took 500 damage. Oh, my eyes! Master, I can't see! <laughs> what trickery is this? Ouch. That hurts. What the heck is this? Pepper spray? Really? God, you two are the worst. I don't think there was another way out of that situation, honestly. We probably would have gotten murked. No. This can't be happening. How could we just lose to the two of them? That doesn't even make sense. I want to go home. Let's get out of here. You said it. I honestly see no other way out of that other than us getting beaten up. I'm so glad I looked in his mom's purse. You coming, Aubrey? Oh. Okay. Catch you later, then. Aubrey. Ugh. Ugh. Why? Why do you guys keep coming back? I just want you to leave me alone. Sokka. Why? Why did you show up? We just want you to stop messing with Basil. What's your deal with him all of a sudden? We used to be friends. We all used to be. You think I'm the bully, but you're all messed up too. Where were you when Mari died? Where were any of you? And you, you're the worst, Basil. How dare you still show your face to me after what you did? Aubrey, I... Get away from me! Shoot. What the heck, Aubrey? What are you doing? You've taken this way too far. Well, wait, hold on. I, I, di I didn't mean to. Sokka, don't worry about Aubrey. I'll keep her busy. Just go help Basil. Do you want to save Basil? Yes. What the hell would I say no for? Is that even really an option? Is this a question? So, because I do, I, you know, I did remember that Amori saw that water earlier when I was trying to do something, and it said that he was afraid, you know, like, that's when all that started creeping around. Did Mari drown? Is that how she died? Bro, the music. Taking that theme from Otherworld Park. Dude. go again.
Something drags you down. Calm down. Let's start with that. Okay. Attack again. Sock is attacked at nothing. Steady your heartbeat. Don't be afraid. It's not as scary as you think. You have to keep going. Don't give up. No matter how impossible it seems. You reach out to the voice and remember how to persist. Heart cannot reach zero for one turn. Interesting. What will Sokka do? Persist again? What will Sokka do? Well, third time seems to charm. Oh, wait, it's Hero. Well, it was a picture of Mari. The picture had Mari in it. Hmm. It looks like Basil's breathing is steady, but we need to get him somewhere warm quickly. Yeah, he's had a rough day. Let's get him home as soon as possible. Wait! Where do you think you're all going? That's enough. Don't you think you've caused enough trouble today? Come on, guys. We've got to go. Are you just not going to let me talk to her? I am not gonna... I just don't get to talk to her. Okay. Alright. Well, Hero's back. Let me save. I'm gonna save... this one. Let's get him back to his house. I thought that was his house. Must be down here. Basil! What happened? Is he okay? His breathing is stable. He just needs a change of clothes and a warm bed. Okay, I, I can do that. Come quick inside. Can you help me bring him to his room? Sure thing. Phew, that was intense. I hope Basil wakes up soon.
Hold on a minute, there was a book in there. Book on plants. Okay, it's just plants. I thought it might have been a journal or something. Okay, I'm really getting tired of seeing that. I just wanted to see if the, anything had flower, happened to the flower. Hey, Kel. Hey, Sokka. Looks like Basil's gonna be just fine. I heard from Nam that Basil was missing and that you two went looking for him. When I was running around the park, I heard some commotion coming from our hangout spot. I guess I got there right in the nick of time. So what was happening back there? Aubrey. She pushed Basil into the lake. What? That was Aubrey back there? No way. She wouldn't do that to Basil. I'm sure there was some kind of misunderstanding. She's not the same person anymore, Hero. She's become all messed up after you left for college. Aubrey. What happened while I was gone? Maybe I should have never left. It's not your fault this happened. Things could have gotten a lot worse if you didn't show up. You've done all you can. Come on, let's go home. You know, Sokka, you were pretty awesome back there, jumping into the lakes to save Basil like that. Even if Hero ended up saving the day, I think you deserve some recognition, too. How about a high five? Do you want a high five, Kel? Yes! Why would I say no to that? I risked my life. <laughs> I don't think there's anything else to do. Unless we can go back? I'm sensing an evil presence coming from inside my room. Maybe I'm overthinking it, but I can never be too careful. This is his house? like the preacher's son find a note ho hum it looks like your trail has gone cold how unfortunate um an assortment of wigs on the table the yellow one is missing Yep, yeah, well, that's his bedroom. Statue of a religious figure. You feel as if it is judging you. Huh. Cardboard cutouts of a pair of twins. There's something stuck on the back. You find a note. It seems we have gone missing. We couldn't have gotten too far. Find us, dear little brother. Signed, Daphne and Bowen, your loving older siblings. What? Why do they have cutouts of themselves? You open the curtains and find some more cardboard cutouts. There's a note on the back. Did you think we only bought one cardboard cutout of ourselves? That would be too, so much less cost effective. Signed, Daphne and Bowen, your older siblings. What? Why, why, why are they even doing this? Check by the bookcase, but you didn't find anything of interest. Interest. Checked under the table, didn't find anything of interest. Where the heck are they then? So then 
not under the table. Um. Boo! <laughs> we got you good, didn't we? Hey, wait a second. You're not our darling little brother. Huh. Huh. Our little brother's too cool for us now, isn't he, Bowen? He doesn't even have time to play games with his loving older siblings anymore. Yes, Daphne. It is very... regrettable. <sighs> we barely get any time off work. And when we do, little Michael is never around to play with us anymore. It's unfair, isn't it, Bowen? Life is so cruel. Well, that's fine. Now we have some new friends. Though, I'm not exactly sure what they do. Entertain us, dear friends. Yes, entertain us. Ah, I see that you have a pet rock, too. Would you, perhaps, like to clash? Huh. We're confident, aren't we? You won't win so easily. Papa Chip, let's show them our power. Is he an oven? Okay, that's off to a bad start. And we're dead. Victory? Hmm. Yes, it seems that we have won. Excellent. Well, this was all very fun, but we get bored very easily. Come, brother. Let us think of more fun games to play. Goodbye, new friends. This has been pleasant. Okay, well... We got rid of the evil out of your house. Was your siblings trying to prank you? I don't know. Ah, so you've conquered the great evil. What did it cost you? I can still see the pain in your eyes. <sighs> My brother and sister are a real drag, aren't they? Everyone here is the same. Ah, uh, they're just gonna say the same thing. I wanna see if I can go back and actually beat them. And if not, well, I'll just end the video. Out of shame. family has owned a bakery for four generations, but our little dear brother has sworn off bread since something or other come around eventually. Alright, let's just beat them. Let's beat them. Let's beat them. So the first time they threw scissors? I think they threw scissors. I throw a rock. Then he threw paper. He did it again. God dang it. Oh, one more time. So these people make bread. So this is the bread making family. And that's... That's already information I knew earlier. It was just all the religious stuff, so I was like, I don't know. Okay, so I'm gonna throw a rock. Does not work. Okay, I'm gonna throw paper this time. Now I'm gonna throw a rock. paper again. Now I'm gonna throw a rock. Okay, I guess I'm gonna throw paper again. Got him. Defeat? Hmm. Yes, it seems that we have lost this round. Unfortunate. Alright, well, we beat them. 
And now it's time for the next episode. Catch you then.